hello hello guys today i'm going to show you um x the xbox year in review 2017 website before it gets taken down and anyway basically it looks very futuristic so you go to now i'm on the um i'm on the current i'm on current you can't see it in the video but i'm on https colon slash slash www.xbox.com slash lowercase e lowercase n dash capital u capital s slash live now i'm going to add, now you're going to add this after those lines this is this, this is for if you may this can live anywhere but it must be after live you have to add slash year dash in dash review you can't see it but but the year and in and review okay all all words i typed in are all lowercase like like life is lowercase year is lowercase in is lowercase and review is lowercase and now once now when you okay guys again i am not posting on the goal website again after that add add, add that command i told you to add and you should be here this is a new year review Guys, awesome animation. Really, really futuristic. Looks like it was made in 2020 or something. Guys, here's the animation again since I couldn't show everything about it. Here's the animation again. That is awesome. This is like seriously, in my opinion, one of the best years in re year in reviews that was ever created. It shows everything from your achievement stats to like everything. It shows your total hours played. It legit shows all your stats. That's aw that's totally awesome, and yes, that's my gamer picture, by the way. This is so so neat. Thirty-one percent hours played in. Not only it's it's so cool, it even has the coolest animations ever. Like like right there. That that's a isn't that supposed to be a gift of some sort? I'm pretty sure. I don't know if it's a gift, but it's animated. It's honestly like moving. This is so awesome because it looks like it was made in like the future. In 2020. Ace. Xbox was so kind enough to give me a player type of Ace. How charming. And it picks up your data from the first of the year to October 31st, 2017. Those played games by Al. See, look, look at all those animations. Looks like Action Adventure is my. That's like my most played. 113 to 53 and then 53 then 22. Most played game, most played month is of course January. The first month shows you your achievements during the time period. Then shows the highest achievement in most played game and that would have to be Roblox. 
Four's company. And then it says that Xbox salutes me. Well, thank you. And um, it says millions of achievements, hours play, and battles won, but there's no one quite like you. Xbox is so nice to me. And then it actually says my um. Uh, that's actually that's actually how many friends I have on Xbox. Friend me if you, friend me if you haven't already. Here's my username on Xbox. Friend me if you haven't already. Wait. It shows you and me the the community. I oh, yep, I'm in the U.S. Wow. Okay, that's one million in the region achievements. And in the global achievements, it's three million. Oh, three, bil- three billion. And then 33. 30, 30, I know that, that's going to be in 62 billion. Okay, so it just goes back and forth. Then your rank versus region of the top 35% on the gamer score. Top 39% on my achievements and top 31% hours played. And then total hours played, 214. Hours played region average, 219. And hours played is world average is 191. So it looks like I, I managed to beat the world. Anyway, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please go and check your own Xbox thing. Go go and check what your year in review was. Anyway, guys, I see you. I'll see you guys next video. Bye.